Hey everyone, welcome to a special video. As always, my name is Jay, and today I'll be unboxing a gift that I got. Today's Christmas Day. It's actually like Christmas Day, 7.30 in the morning, and I'm so excited. I got a gift today, or this week, from Mr. Cody Roo. So I decided that it'd be kind of fun to do an unboxing gift video on Christmas Day, and I'll probably be up tomorrow on Boxing Day, because I'm leaving right after this to go visit some family. But uh, yeah, I'm super really excited. So. Let's I'll open this gift and see Cody Roo got me. I'm, I'm excited because Mr. Cody Roo is like, he's like kit ba he's like the ultimate kit, kit basher for orc players. So I'm excited. So let's see what he got. I'm excited. Mm -hmm. So hey everyone, let me open this up quickly. Let's see what I got. I'm excited. This is crazy. I always surprises me when I get gifts in the mail randomly. So I'm just gonna quickly carefully open this up hobby knife. That way I don't want to it'll go too crazy and, and open it up too quickly and break it. His only hint to me was that he hoped it, it uh, stayed together. So it may not be, unfortunately, because the post office, you know, isn't the most... I like them, but they're not the most gentle. So let's open that up. Ooh, I'm excited! <laughs> That's amazing. He uh, he had a checklist of the secret Orky project. <laughs> Design something crumpy or something cunning. Loot the parts. Fix it up good and proper. Add deck. I can't go through all of them. It's awesome. And finally, wah! So. <laughs> That's amazing. I'll read the note after because uh, it's early. So here we go. It's just. Uh, Open this right here. Packing peanuts. Packing peanuts. Packing peanuts. I'm gonna have to. Um, I think I'm gonna put these packing peanuts for a second. Oh, whoop. They're everywhere. Whoop. Wow. Oh my goodness. I don't know if it's in one. Very cool stuff. I think that's it. Oh no, there's another part. Okay. Wow. That's it. Awesome. A lot of packing peanuts. I like that. Once I get to reuse the packing peanuts in the future. I want to say that it's a person that you uses all their packing peanuts. So that's it. Cool. So two pieces. Let's zoom in on this now. Let's get a good look at this. Whoop. Perfect. Excellent. Here we go. I'm, I don't even know what it is. I'm excited. This is, I'm sorry, I just keep saying that, but it's really true. I've been, I got this package like three days ago, but the rule was I had to wait till Christmas day to open it because my wife's one of those people, you know, you have to wait till Christmas day. I was like, oh, that makes sense. I know, but. Oh, it was like the three days before Star Wars came out. Amazing! Look at this. I, I know what it is. It's a. I'm pretty certain it's a looted wagon, and it's in the image of Morkatron and Gorkatron, uh, Cody Roo's two looted wagons. Because you can clearly see the the grot on the back and the button. That that is the red button. You can't press that. So I'm just gonna put it together. I'm pretty sure this will probably be the head. That is amazing. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much, Cody Roo. I know you'll be watching this video eventually, but uh, I'm blown away. What's in this one? Some green. So I'm opening it. Woo. Wow. So this has a head. Oh, the green is just the a lot. The uh... so just some extra squigs to attach. 
Excellent. So here's some just extra DACA. Here's a head. This is amazing. As you can see, like, look at the ingenuity that Cody Rue puts into these things. It just blows me away. It really does. Just blows my brain. That so this would be, I'm guessing. Oh, whoop, where did that go? Hmm. Probably here somewhere. Probably on the other hand. Maybe there? I'll have to figure this one out. I don't know where this part goes. I'm trying to think of it as ingenuity. Hmm. It's a big gun, big gun, big gun. Probably right here is my guess. Yep. Look at that. It's magnetized. That is amazing. Wow. I love it. I gotta paint this thing up in the near future. That is amazing. So it is a, a looted wagon. Or it could be like a grot tank. I could probably play this as a grot tank as well, depending on, like a grot mega tank. Uh, if I, I probably play this as a grot mega tank if I wanted to proxy or a looted wagon. Either one would be amazing. I think it's a looted wagon because the, the big key is this right here. Don't press that. All right, that's the big red button. That is amazing. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit more. Just show you guys, this is just, and these, just, this bag just has a squig, a couple squigs, a couple more grots, a couple more DACA things. That is, I'm, I'm honestly just blown away at his ingenuity and his orkiness. You know, this doesn't look like anything, it looks like Morgatron and Gorgatron, obviously. But um, it doesn't look anything like GW produces, but it's so orky, you know? No one would deny that this is not orky enough. It's very orky. In fact, I, I love the fact that it's magnetized. I didn't even realize that. Look at that. Just the whole side? Yeah, look at that. That's amazing. That's not magnetized. Okay, don't break it. Wow. So look at this. We have the head here from the Morkanok Gorkanok kit. This is my favorite grot. I always love the fact that he always ends up on a cannon. Uh, giant cannon. This is the exhaust of a, I'm guessing a plane, a DACA jet. Tons of DACA. This is from the Morkanok Gorkanok kit, I'm pretty sure. Rocket set. A couple spots. Oh, that's where the plasma is going to go. The, uh, the, I see the plasma guns in here are the flamers. I can put them in the side spots. And so this is definitely a looted wagon, I guess, but it's, it's just amazing. Orc head at front. I just, I'm completely blown away. Completely blown away. I could not picture this in my head because Cody Rue is like a mad genius. Him and Cruz, he called, you know, Cruz Azul. He, uh, he's like a mad doc and, or a Big Mac. And what he thinks of in his head and he puts together is just beyond my comprehension. And I just can't, first of all, I couldn't think about putting this kit together in my head. Like I, I just couldn't, I'm not a good kit basher. And, uh, I'm, I love it. And these are tanks, like, these are parts from uh, Lehman Russ. So, wow. I, I'm, I'm speechless. This is just amazing. Gun turrets, like, so much DACA. And he's getting more DACA. So giant cannon, flamers. This is the most DACA I've ever had on a vehicle. By far. And I love the little grunt. His job is to don't press that. Don't do it. Mm -mm. I gotta paint that red. That's amazing. And he's a little screen. I'm guessing this will be like a little screen. And uh, I'll paint that and it's, let's say, don't press that. Mm -mm. I love, as I said, the little things that he thinks about. Like the little uh, grot on top of the guns. You know, the exhausts. Like, it just... Uh, thank you so much, Cody Roo. I I'm blown away. I didn't... I could not ever think of this in my wildest dreams. And it was it's so cool. And it's very much in the style of Morgatron and Gorkatron, and I love it. They're, anybody who's seen my battle reports with Cody Rue, you know that I love his orkiness and the way he, he kit bashes things, and he is such an, a custom army because of it. I am going to have so much fun painting this guy up in the future. Uh, I'm just going to open up this bag and see the little things. I think, I'm pretty sure there's more DACA, because you can't have enough DACA. A couple squigs. I'm thinking, whoa, this squig is like really... That's a dark squig, like, looks evil. Look at him. I love it. I'm probably gonna put him, like, right here. So he's telling the, uh, the grot not to press that. And if he gets pressed that, he gets fed to the squig. <laughs> Another, like, mutated squig. I love it. And then just a lot of DACA. Some flamers, some melta, some plasma. Ooh, another grot or two. 
I'm gonna have to put them all. I, I'm gonna have to figure out where I'm gonna put them. But I'm thinking I might put them to continue the tradition. I'm gonna put one here on this turret and one on the other turret. I think that would be a great one. So they have a guy on each turret, guy in the front, guy in the back. And there's a guy up here. That would be, yeah, it fits perfectly. Look at that. I think Cody was thinking that. I think he's thinking about one step ahead of me. So this drought is definitely gonna go, I think, right here. Wow, I, I'm blown away, people. I love it. This, it's just, wow. You know, when somebody takes the time from their schedule to build you something like this, and this didn't take a few minutes, right? This is, it's very orky, but there's no way this took him a few minutes. This took him days and days. You know, it blows me completely away. I love it. What do you guys think? I'm, I'm in love right now with this. Completely blown away. Amazing Christmas gift. I cannot, oh, I'm, 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 I love it. I'm honestly, I'm almost in tears. I love it. So thank you so much, Mr. Cody Roo. Thank you so much. I, I, I love it so much. I'm going to just end here because I'm going to get teary eyed and yeah, I got to stop before I get teary eyed. So that concludes my unboxing video. I am just blown away. I, I love it so much. I can't wait to paint it up and have so much fun painting this dude up. I, I love it so much, Mr. Cody. Roo. Thank you so much for it. I, I can't, I don't even know what to say. This is just amazing. So thank you so much for watching this unboxing video. It's going to be unboxing day, I guess. It's going to be unboxing day, but that'll be cool. And uh, let me know in the comments section down below if you got any crazy gifts that just moved you like I just got from this. Um, this is crazy. I, I love it. So hopefully you all get something that blows you away as much as I'm blown away right now by this. And I got another toy to paint up. This is just oh, amazing. So thank you so much for watching. Most importantly, Merry Christmas. Hope you have a great, safe, happy holiday season. Until next time, this is Jay saying, happy painting, everyone.